Recording commence. This officially starts off your official kickoff of the weekend, I guess. Congratulations, depending on what time zone this comes out in whenever you're watching this on a Friday, because that's the rule. If you're watching this on a non-Friday, you have to stop watching this and uh, come back when it is. I mean, you can set your computer to a Friday in order to keep watching this if you really need to see it now. But that's the rules. You got to watch this on a Friday because you can't start watching a video for a Friday on an odd Friday when it's, you know, supposed to kick off your weekend. If you're watching this on a Tuesday, you're just like, oh, fuck. Team's all excited about there being a Friday and this is what happens. It's Tuesday and so I got to wait through the rest of the week. Oh, that just sucks. Anyway, challenge start. I went on the GeoGuessr subreddit and there was a whole bunch of theme maps set up and one of them was this one this specific person said it was his favorite places and the caption for it said I would trust this person's decisions on very interesting places so I was I took a bit the bullet whatever you want to call it and we're going to find out just how interesting these places are This looks to be Greek in some sense, just because this is the only country that uses the Greek alphabet. Anyway, let's get through the no more preamble, shall we? This is GeoGuessr here on this YouTube channel. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Sorry for the sniffles. It's a little cold outside. <clears throat> um... Here on this channel, every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, we do uh, GeoGuessr maps. Uh, Mondays currently are doing uh, states in the United States, alphabetically. Uh, and then the other two days are whatever. Um, and I do say, if you guys have a suggestion for a map, theme, country, or any other suggestion, give me a bunch of maps you've decided to do yourself. Go ahead and put them in the comments below. I will do them. And probably do them during that week. I don't know. It really depends on how my uh, recording plans are. Right now, they're still doing them the night before they go up. That may change in the future. Who knows? Anyway, past couple of Christ, it's only been, might have been three months now. I don't know exactly. Uh, this is me. Lemons has been so kind to us to provide uh, maps to do. And I very much thank him for their gift municipality of Harrisonisos uh, Harrisonisos I don't know if I'm going to if I'm going to see that I mean this definitely looks really cool uh I'll give them that but I don't know if I'm actually going to see yeah municipalities so I got to get like close to the border here and then it'll tell me I don't know I don't see anything did I actually click on the country? Did I do that at least? Okay, I did. We're not near Lamia. We're in the mountains, all right. So maybe we're like over here. Although there's a lot of mountains in this part of the country. Or continent, I should say. It is very arid. Lots of footpaths, it looks like, everywhere. <clears throat> I don't know what's happening in my voice, but... Looking forward to the weekend. I do have a bone in need of picking with this uh, upcoming weekend. The very much bullshit thing is happening. Um, that lake or clouds? That just clouds. Um, I'm of the thought process that, hey, it's... Uh, I, I talked about this on Wednesday, so I'll make this fast, because I just remembered I did. It's going to be 50 degrees on uh, tomorrow. Oh, yeah, tomorrow. And I want to hike. I'm not going to be able to hike. Because it's going to be raining in 50. That really uh, cans my peaches, chaps my ass, bumps me out. Just because I have not hiked all this month yet. And I kind of want to. Uh, let me see. I want to see if I can actually... I can't. Find out exactly where this is. Oh, we do have a thing here. Oh, see, this would have helped me. Minoan Settlement. We were on the island. 
Okay. I got the country right at least. That's a pretty cool place to see. <clears throat> Tavola Calda. This seems to be a Central European square of some sort, potentially Italian. Because I think this is Piazza, like the famous um, catcher for the New York Mets. For the Marlins and the Dodgers, I think. It's been a while. Where'd that car go? S car go. My car go. <clears throat> I'm going to pause because I got a cough. Oh, my apologies. Um, let us try to find out where we are. Can I go over here? I can. Hello, Bamblands. This feels Italian. Sicilian. It is dot it let's see misericordia firenze fm is this like a florence thing this could be oh this is that thing there was a uh documentary i saw something of like superhuman people and i remember them actually having this guy i think he's blind or something else, some sort of vision impaired type thing. Or he, and they put him in front of this thing and he drew it. Like, I could be misremembering how it went, but they put him in front of this big giant building and either he saw it for a split second or was just described it or heard it. And he was able to uh, basically draw this thing. And it matched it perfectly. Let's go to Itali. I don't know what city this is. It starts with an F, so maybe I'll just say we're in Florence. Very old, old timey. Yeah, I think it might be around this thing. So it might be like right there. Interesting. Near the Battistero di Mini to Mimi. That's my Italian. Maybe I. D. Uh, oh, I can't really make it out. <clears throat> this is a really cool building. wonder how long ago this is. It's a little dirty. He's a little cleaning. Very gold doors. Everyone with their photos. What is this a shirt of? Radio something or other. It's a cool looking place. Um, feeling really cold right now. Fingertips and toes. Very much uncomfortable right now, but that's neither here nor there. What are these like in case Debris falls down? They catch it? I don't think it's a people catcher. I don't, I don't think they allow people in all these places. <clears throat> it's interesting about a lot of these super, super old buildings. At least in Europe, where they'll have people actually be able to go into it, but there's a lot of it that they're just like, nah, we're not letting people in it. Uh, I mean, there were times probably 300 years ago, you could just have people just going willy nilly everywhere. Like, whenever this thing was built, I'm sure, yeah, I, th it was probably all this stone here too, but just imagine what this smelled like before they had public sewers. The stink, the trenches, and just how that's how normal it was, I guess, then, because they didn't know any different. I'm sure they were just like, yeah, maybe it stinks, but fucking everything stinks. I only lived the 30 years, then I'm dead. <clears throat> I got more things to worry about than, oh, we were a block away. It was close, so we were near, oh, yeah, we were back here. I should have put a little bit more thought into it, because I would have made definitely way more sense that we were going to be right there, but I got to cough again. Sorry, clearing my throat. Hmm. So far, that's a pretty cool place to go see. This feels German. That looks like a, that's Mag, Maggers. Maggers? Magners? It's a British cider. Or Irish cider? No, I don't know. We're in England still. Or plots. We're, we're in Europe is what I meant to say. Uh, so we're, at, we're in front of 
a gate, a very old timey gate. <clears throat> Let's see what this says. Wasserberg and Eversberg. Let's zoom in. Uh, I don't know if I'm, yeah, because I got to go way in to see these numbers here. The 304s. Man, I got to cough again. I'm sorry. Okay. Throat's giving me a bit of issue right now, but, you know, I can't do these sign language or pantomiming because I don't think it would work. 312. So maybe we're in here. I think I'm, I feel like I'm going about this all wrong, but also I feel like I'm close. 317, 304. Maybe we're in here. <clears throat> My throat is just fighting me the whole way. All right, one more pause. I did have a thought for an invention that someone probably, okay, here we go, probably shouldn't make. We're in Munich. Okay, so we're near the Um, some sort of gate. I'm just going to click us here. Looking for anything that kind of looks like that gate thing, like a plot. So let me hit, no, I think we're basically, we're basically in here. So 304 is right there. So we're like along here somewhere. So maybe, yeah, maybe, no, that doesn't look like the gate, but I'm going to put us right here anyway. I'm going to hit home just so I can kind of like get an idea. This is just very much in the middle. It's a very long kind of strip of grass here. That might be this. No, it's not. <clears throat> All right. Hmm. Zoom in a bit and try to take a look around. Spielplatz. Istas. Istator Platz. Looking for some plots. Oh, anyway, the invention that I was going to come up with was some sort of throat squeegee. Like, I know that there, there was a method for cleaning out um, uh, paintball guns when the paintballs explode inside the barrels. It's like this <clears throat> long tube with a uh, round type rubber disc at the end of it that you kind of have a little string that goes from one end to the other to like tighten it up so it comes completely flush with one end of the tube and then you pull it through to squeegee like that. Make something like that for your throat to just completely get rid of all the stuff in your throat and you just want to clear it out. I'm sure that there's a lot of problems with that, like constantly fighting your want and need to throw off for the gag thing. I don't know if that's a thing you can power through. And I can't imagine actually how weird that would feel. Oh, we were over here. In front of what? Istartor, huh? Oh, this is a stadium? Hmm. Interesting. More Europe? Um, potentially. We got some Fiats. This feels southern Italy, maybe. Let's go over here. It's Capitolo. It's the Museum of the Capital Cathedral of St. Lorenzo. Maybe. I don't know. <clears throat> maybe this is Portugal. Why isn't it? This must be like off season, maybe in the fall or something. Nobody's here. Oh, there's a. It is Ital Italian. We're in the country of Italian. My fucking brain. Don't want to work. Can I get on the other side of this sign? I, I just want to see. Purple vibes, huh? What do we got? Piazza November. Corso Venucci, huh? I don't know what any of that means. I need to find out. Can I go this way? I cannot. Okay, fine. Can I go this way? 
I'm going to go back towards the center of the square here. Yeah, let me choose my destiny. Let's head this way. All right, so we're constructing some stuff now. Hmm. Oh, I guess I can't go any more this way. What are we, what are we starting here? Can't tell. Um. All right, let's head this way. My phone's blowing up. Oh, my girlfriend's being loopy, I think, right now. I'll look at this. It's a silly video. <clears throat> I need a drink. Hmm. So, I know this is Italy, but the problem is figuring out where it is in the country. My only guess is I need to get outside these buildings, number one. <clears throat> and because this all feels like sandstone work or something, and I can't really tell. Okay, I do have plenty of time. We do have some... Would that be challah food? Uh, halal. I'm an idiot, not... <laughs> I got the bread confused with halal, so... Yeah. Oh, uh, man, this is just a non-stop deluge of... Uh, same stone buildings. And I'm not finding anything helpful here. I gotta make a guess in 58 seconds. We're in southern Italy, maybe in like uh it even could be one of the islands, but I'm gonna put us like I feel Naples is too big to be this place. And that's 30 seconds. No. Um, hit home real quick. I want to look at that sign. I don't know if this is going to help me. Yeah, Lorenzo, that's, that's not helpful. 20 seconds left. I'm going to say we're like in the toe down here or something. Or maybe I'll put us in Naples and just be done with it. It's like, I don't know. I'm sure once it's done, it'll say, oh, we act it said it all over the place. Oh, we were farther up north, huh? In uh, Peru, huh? What's the name of this? Oh, it's the plaza of the 4th of November, huh? We're outside a very large square. What do we got? Dot com, that doesn't help me. Hmm. Looking at this <clears throat> roof work, we have a, okay, this, this doesn't tell me anything. I was going to say Germany, but it's not Germany, and this is some weird, um, giant black box, lots of cobblestone everywhere. Is this Italy again? Man loves Italy. No. This could be Spanish. Hmm. Gotta keep going. This looks like a... We got a Trattoria. That's an Italian thing, I believe. This is a... Very old building. With some very old wording on it that I will not be able to tell. It's gonna say Centro. Police us Stradale. So I guess we're back in friggin' Italy again, man. All right, we get it. You like Italy. I think that tells me the shape of the... Um... Oh, it's gone here, huh? This is going to tell me the shape of the uh, town we're in. This still could feel Portuguese to me. I don't know why I'm having this hang up here, but there's enough here to make me second guess myself. Scola dos. I need to get next to like that banner over there. That would be helpful. I don't think it's going to happen. Let me hit right here. Whoa. That's not what I wanted. Let me get back. Thank you. Ooh, this may help me. Bassoni Automobile. 
Beely, that doesn't help me nearly enough. Maybe a little closer? Come on. We got Impero Nightclub. They're going with the Roman theme. This is probably Italy again. Um, I don't know. Seems everyone's wearing like sweaters and shit, but it's Piazzo Ducal. Ingresso. Yeah, the Italian flag. Man, this guy this guy loves Italy. Your uh Ani needs a little bit of work. Seems like Bibite fresh. What are we selling off of you? Larone da Vigilanza. You like security? Vigilanza. What do we got here? Museum. It's an archaeological national archaeological museum, huh? Of Mantova. <laughs> like I know what that is. Hmm. So I gotta get outside the town to actually see what the wow, this opens up real quick. I can't tell if this is a pack of cigarettes or pasta. I'm going to say it's bow tie pasta. I mean, it looks like a carton of cigarettes. But, shit, I got no time left. We're in Florence. <laughs> <laughs> no, we were, we were close, though. In Minuta. Wait, I think it maybe said Minuta somewhere. Right in uh, the Piazza Sordello. Anyway. Would I go to any of these places he listed? Some, yes. Um, even though there's 250 plus images, or there's a lot of images here. It just happened to be that we got a lot of Italian ones, but what are you going to do? Excuse me. That is the nature of the beast. Anyway, your week's done. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Um, we'll do a quick little catch up on the rest of the things that have gone out this week. Some really terrible Rainbow Six Siege went out. I'm really kind of embarrassed at my ability. I am trying to do better uh, as I've mentioned so many times playing that. I just need to practice more and hopefully I can get enough time in to at least improve enough to make it watchable I think. Anyway thank you all for watching. If you have any how much questions, concerns, complaints, suggestions for maps, anything GeoGuessr related, go ahead, put them in the comments below. Same thing with any other games you'd like me to try. Go ahead, put them in the comments down there. I will look at them and get back to you. Okay, as I said at the beginning of the video, your weekend is now started. Again, you, start, you went all the way through this and you're on like a Tuesday or a Wednesday, you only have yourself to blame. Because you're not getting those weekend vibes now. You're just going to be like, oh, it's, 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 I still have so many days left. I've thrown my whole week off. I'm going to wake up tomorrow thinking it's Friday and I'm just going to be bummed. You can't do that to yourself. Save this for a Friday and uh, we'll see you real soon, folks. Goodbye.